Basically, the resilience project has taught myself and, and my fellow teammates, you know, there's little things that you can do every day to put yourself in a better frame of mind. Well, we're custodian of these young men and it's important that we do what we can to ensure that they're better human beings and if that leads to better performance and that's a great outcome. We thought that this program could have something to do with putting life into perspective and ensuring that our people are mentally stronger to cope with the challenges that life will undoubtedly throw at them. Hugh from the Resilience Project has been running several sessions at the Melbourne Storm, but not just with the players, with the admin staff. Uh, all our age group representation sides, and I think it's been profoundly and really well received across the group. And I, I, I believe the real litmus test was that the senior players and the junior players asked that their wives, girlfriends and partners could come in and have the same information presented to them. I think for them, it actually felt that someone understood what they were going through for the first time. It's, it's not just someone preaching um, about mental health, it's about real life stories, it's really hits home and uh, I'm a little bit sceptical when it comes to these sorts of things and we sit in the team room. Uh, this time I actually wanted, wanted to sit there for longer and listen to more and um, we had to, had to cut it off there because we had to start training but I could have sat there for hours. I think this is a, a great project for not just sporting organisations but schools all over Australia. I'm a huge proponent of what you've done. Um, the response has been phenomenal. And uh, in fact, I had someone say to me yesterday, of the 15 years I've been at the club, that is the single best presentation I've had.